Recently, new theories have emerged that challenge our understanding of this iconic atmospheric formation, suggesting that the great red spot we see today may not be the same storm observed centuries ago. In 1665, Italian astronomer Giovanni Cassini recorded a giant dark spot on Jupiter, which he called the permanent spot. This feature, perhaps first noted by English scientist Robert Hooke in 1664, disappeared from observations by 1713. For many years, astronomers believed that the permanent spot was the same as the modern Great Red Spot, first observed in 1831 at the same latitude. However, a recent study led by Augustine Sanchez La Vega of the University of Basque Country suggests otherwise. After analyzing the size and movement of these vortices over time, the researchers concluded that it's highly unlikely that the current Great Red Spot is the same as Cassini's permanent spot. Most likely, the original storm disappeared between the mid-18th and 19th centuries, making the current Great Red Spot a younger formation with a lifespan of more than 190 years. Using historical data, Sanchez La Vega and his team performed computer modeling to figure out how the Great Red Spot might have formed. The leading theory is that wind instability in Jupiter's atmosphere created the elongated atmospheric cell we see today. 